Okay, we have a compact Rosario. This is the SR1403WM. That is Sierra Romeo 1403 Whiskey Mike. It is a compact Rosario, mid size tower. It's a very nice unit. We've got a dual uh, disc player. This is a uh, DVD rewritable, writable, read DVD ROMs. And this one is a uh, DVD reader only, I believe. So if we're needing to uh, copy to one or to the other, um, we also have here the memory card reader where can Compact Flash uh, 1 and 2, Smart Media and XD, MMC and SD. Uh, this is a USB port. And then we have a Memory Stick Pro. This is FireWire, two more USB. Uh, this is a headphone jack out. This would be microphone in, and this would be an auxiliary in. And then this is the power button. Uh, this is an AMD Centron, and this was uh, came with Windows Windows XP Home Edition, and it is a great little machine. It also is bundled with this HP brand, of course, Compaq HP owned or same company, different labels basically. But it comes with an HP. It is a VS17E. That's Victor Sierra 17 Echo. It is a 17-inch full-color monitor, and it has built-in speakers, which there's an audio cable that comes to the headphone or the audio jack for the back. And so I can demonstrate real fast that it does have sound. I don't think I have a sound file on this right now. Um, there's also a Roxios uh, CD DVD creator, so you can do drag-and-drop files to uh, rewritables, or you can burn complete discs. It has, uh, what is it? Intro Video Home Theater, which is a DVD codec player so that you can watch movies and whatnot on it. Okay, so let's show you what is at the heart of this. Now, I have pictures, you can't see it in the video, but this is, does have the Service Pack 3 with all the latest um, security patches, updates, and everything beyond that. And this is the AMD Athlon 64 3200 Plus, and it does have two gigabytes of, of, of RAM which is plenty for Windows XP. You may want to consider a couple more if you upgrade this to Windows 7 rank. Um, let's see here. We have also put an optional Wi-Fi adapter in it. This is a PCI adapter, so you see right here. So you do not have to physically plug into this. It will operate like your tablet and other things, just off your Wi-Fi signal. And, ugh. all right. We are operating off of VGA, that is the built-in or onboard um, video signal that is here. There's an available slot. At one time we did have an additional video card, um, but you can put an additional video card or some other expansion here. Um, it's using the PS2, stock PS2, which uh, mouse and keyboard. And it does have, for instance, oh, I haven't programmed it. There's buttons here for volume up and down as well as mute. So, you can set this up where these buttons would actually control the volume up and down or mute so that if you're listening, you don't have to drive in with the mouse. Okay, so back to here, we've got a parallel port. We've got, um, as we said, the VGA. There are four USB high-speed 2.0. Um, we have an Ethernet adapter so that you can physically connect to a home network if you have uh, Ethernet using uh, you know, gigabit or 100 base, uh, whatever. Um, we have a modem. So there is a modem. You can uh, run this as a fax or whatever else. And then, of course, we have digital audio out, and we have microphone, another uh, uh, audio out for headphone, and this is the microphone in. And then, once again, like I said, this would be your, your Wi-Fi antenna. So, let's demonstrate that the Wi-Fi works. So, I have connected to my home Wi-Fi, and we will see here that I am connected. Uh, right now, I'm, it's on the other side of the room, but I have 48 megabits per second and uh, signal strength, I have about three bars, two bars, because our wall here is about like lead shield. And if I wanted to, whoops, if I wanted to, so you can see that here are all the wireless, my neighbors, mine, everything else that we can connect to and do that. So you can connect it physically, um, you can connect it wirelessly, you could connect both as a backup if you want to. All right, um, it does have also installed in it, this is nice, this is handy for you, is it does have preloaded Microsoft Office uh, 2003. It is the standard version, so we have Word, 
We have Excel, uh, PowerPoint, and it would have Outlook. Um, it also has preloaded onto this. Um, like I said, it's got Roxio Easy Media Creator, so you can create CDs and DVDs, whether that's data backups or I think it can do audio as well. And then, my goodness, hit the wrong thing. And uh, let's see, oh, and then we do have pre-installed, uh, the newest version of a vast antivirus with all of the updates to it. It's excellent. It is one of the highest rated with the lowest resource um, use, meaning it uses less memory and mess, less processing power in the background than most. Um, and it does as good or better job than most. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's anything else here. Uh, there's the InterVideo Win DVD so that you can watch DVDs. It's pre installed Adobe Acrobat Reader so you can look at PDFs and stuff. We did drop on the newest version of CC Cleaner. Uh, that's something so that you can routinely uh, clean out cash and cookies and stuff if you want. It'll go in and do a registry fix and check for errors and things like that. Excellent. I've used it for years. We uh, have Internet Explorer, which of course came default with it, and we installed Google Chrome. Um, I prefer Google Chrome most of the time. All right. So let me, let's take a look at the hard drive that's on this. This has a 300 gigabyte hard drive. Looks like capacity 320, so about 300 gigabytes, right? So um, it's got about 281 gigabytes that's available. And with your USB, or, or you could open up the side port and put another drive in it or something. Um, this came originally with Windows XP, so it's not a brand new computer, but the hard drive in it um, was replaced between a year and a year and a half ago. So the hard drive itself should be very reliable for, for many years. And uh, the memory it's, was also replaced because I think it's originally had one gigabyte and uh, it was replaced out with two. So all in all, nice. Um, used it, we're the original owners of this. And if you have any questions, go ahead and text, call or email. And we can answer that for you. We have a variety of other things that we're getting rid of. I've just saved too many things over the years. Uh, we have tablets, uh, some laptops, uh, we've got scanners, uh, we've got a uh, Sirius satellite, radio, an extra dock. I've got some additional monitors, some other desktop computers, some odds and ends. Tons of t just time to do the spring cleaning. Um, so let us know if you uh, look at our ad, uh, click on the see other ads in Craigslist, or if you happen to have been on eBay or something where we're doing some of look at our other items. Thanks a lot.